Yo guys, it's Keralis, and welcome back everybody to the Minecraft Inspiration series with me, Keralis, and... Andy is Yoda, what's up guys? Hi Sandy. Hey, how you doing? Dude, I'm doing fantastic, and I even feel better when I'm seeing this structure in front of us. Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> Another treat for you today, guys. Inspiration, inspiration, inspiration. And as previous video we did, we did it on a private server just because the shaders mod is kind of buggy. This is the same deal, guys. So as you can see, this is a this is a private server. This is just a schematic of it placed here. But if you want to come on the server, check it out yourselves. There's coordinates and IP, not in the toilet IP, just IP and coordinates to this place in the description below the video. Right, Andy? Yep. To buggy get these shaders. Buggy shaders. I hate buggy shaders. But you know what? They're, they're gonna be fixed. They're working on it. I hope so. I got, that beta, I got faith. Don't we? Oh, beta. We got, we got faith in this. And dude, tell me mm -hmm. about this place. This is a train station and it's by Jumijumur. Shumal? Shumal, one of the trusted on the server. I am flying about too fast. Speed one. And uh, yeah, it's the train station from Antwerp in Belgium. Antwerp, Belgium. Is there any in Belgian people in the house? Europe. Let us know in the comment section. Is this, like, is this supposed to be like a replica of it or? Just like ideas and stuff coming from it, you think? No, this is pretty much bang on the money. I mean, I'm looking For at real? the um, I'm looking at the Wikipedia page right now, and it is spot on, actually. Oh my god! I'm not sure about the inside being absolutely spot on, but from the outside. Awesome. What do you think the B stands for? Is it like German niche? Like, I don't know, like Belgium. Is this like, that, that is like, what is it? B for Belgium. No, no. Uh, this is B for Berkeley because this place is in oh, Berkeley. I see, I see, I see. I kind of felt like, well, okay, maybe they like, they are a bit of French speaking there, maybe some German speaking in, in I don't know. What language do they speak? Uh, Flemish? Flemish, I think. Flemish? Yeah. But I think they speak Dutch and German and just. Everything really. Yeah, because I was thinking like Banhof, maybe something, but yeah. Nah, maybe, maybe, nah, it doesn't Bertley, matter. Bertley. Bertley, all right. Dude, <laughs> let's take a spin around this place. Let's go inside and check it out from the inside. And everybody, like, you know what I like about this? Is those towers, like the whole front is made out of those um, stair blocks. Yeah, he's done well actually. And they kind of, I like how they kind of link up to the side, mm -hmm. kind of flow around in little lines. Just for inspiration, everybody. And like, uh, it's really hard to see in a video like this, but, but. Do come on the server. Everybody can join on a PC. Just everybody can join a server to about and just count some blocks, get more inspiration from it. So please feel free to do so because we're kind of like, you know, this is not going to be a very long video. And if you want to just get like, you know, the details incorrectly, come on the server and check it out yourselves. Please do so. But uh, damn, dude, he's amazing looking. Yeah, Jimmy was one of the best builders on the server. He is a detail master. Mastermind. <laughs> And uh, I'm dropping a few frames here as well, even though this is on <laughs> private server. <laughs> Dude, I, I, I tell you, I'm not having much luck here as well. This is it's a sh freaking shaders mod. Like, yeah, it's just so demanding. And even though if you get a good PC, whatnot, I mean, it's just brutal on your, on your okay. PC. I think it's just fried my PC. I'm taking off shaders. <laughs> Oh, there I'm, we go. <laughs> I'm, I'm <laughs> well, still fine. I'm still fine. You're gonna though. wait until we get on the inside, right? Yeah, I'm gonna take them off on the inside, guys, because I tried to record with the shaders and I got 10 FPSers on the inside. That is a no-go zone. No-go mm -hmm. zone. Oh, dude, mm -hmm. I mean, <laughs> this is not a small place. <laughs> no, this is it's beautiful. Holy it's crap! <laughs> and there's like layers and layers uh -huh. of uh -huh. of Bahnhof, or I mean, uh, like tracks or something. Yeah, I mean, this was uh, a replacement railway station for the original. And then, I think, was it 1998? Uh, yeah, a large scale reconstruction. And then they dug right down underground and then they put in more um, tracks and more trains and tubes and tunnels and all sorts. I like it. I mean, this is, by the way, this is kind of simple for, for railway uh, road tracks, but this works so beautiful, put beautifully. I, I mean, look at this just some cobblestone stairs and some spruce awuda. And it's oh, easy, nice. and to curve it, you just mm, just yeah, move, just move, set it set it on side. One, yeah, move it to one side, and that's it. From a distance, it looks fine. Ah, now that dome was made by a different architect from the red uh, train shed. <laughs> so let, I've got his name here. Um, so the dome and this building was made by Louis de la Sensori. I've, I've really <laughs> derped up that pronunciation. Are you talking like a real life situation now? Yeah, or... like a real architect in, in Antwerp. Oh, the, so... the guy that made this bit. So Louis. Louis. Louis we'll made call him that. Louis. Yeah. Louis. <laughs> and then the train shed. 
and was by Van Bogart. Van, oh yeah, I can see it. Van Bogart, yeah. Yeah. All right, so welcome to Antwerp train uh, railway station. Main builder architect, Kumal. A little bit of history. This station was built in 1895. It was designed by Van Bogart. Yeah. B Booger. Van Booger did the train <laughs> shed. <laughs> the Van Booger and train shed. And Louis blah, 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 did the, uh, the this dome. beautiful bit. Look at the ceiling. I know. <laughs> Amount of detail. Are you kidding me? This is what dry, draws the eye, right? When you come in. <sighs> Unreal. Holy crappers. I mean, if this exists in real life, I want to go to Antwerp just to check it out. I mean, this is impressive. Yeah. Oh, I'm looking at the pictures on Wikipedia, guys. I'll put a link in my description to the Wikipedia. And uh, yeah, these arches, what are they made of? <laughs> end stone. Oh, is that end stone? I never would have thought of that. Oh. In terms of counting blocks as well, to get the perfect arch, three, two, two, one, 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 two, two, three. Clever. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> totally speechless. So where do we go from here? Okay, we got a little, sh is there like shops or something here on the side? Yeah, there's little shops, cafes, whatnot. Oh, I think the copy paste has kind of dripped up the signs, right? It's because yeah. it's, it's nulling all over the place. <laughs> and then, <laughs> Red beans and rice. No, uh -huh. fish. No, 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 no. No, spaghetti and meats, meat sauce. Turkey and fried chicken. Turkey That'll... and chicken, baked. Yeah. Gravy and rice. <laughs> that, sounds, that sounds really like nice. Just, with, with, just, with just, so just gravy and rice. <laughs> gravy and rice with just... a side of no. <laughs> no. Can I have extra no, please? <laughs> Baked macaroni and cheese. Mashed potatoes. With, with extra null. <laughs> <laughs> extra null on everything, dude. Um, okay, so we got a little restaurant on that side. And then in the other corner, we can nip up the stairs. <laughs> Let's nip it up. Oh, here. Yeah. Do you think in real life there would be an escalator? Like another escalator, I mean an elevator here? There is an elevator somewhere in this build. I can't quite remember. No. Dude, are you kidding me? <laughs> this place is too big. One to one racer? Not an Apple device. <laughs> 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 so this is like little office spaces here as well, and just overlooking the. I think jumio has got an Apple computer. Why has he done that? <laughs> Spore Railways. Oh, Spore Freak's been oh, doing Spore Freak. Yeah, I did not know that. Oh, dude, this is kind of like those uh, double decker trains. Ah, yeah, I've been in one of them in Italy. They're it's, awesome. Yeah, I've been as well, but it's gonna kind of suck. Mm. In this scenario. Definitely not a disabled entrance. <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> wow. Has he done stuff on the inside on trains as well? How do I get up? <laughs> Someone's put a message here, look. <laughs> dude, <laughs> dude, I love it. There's like a little ladder going on. Let me Is see it? where. Someone's put a sign. <laughs> How do I get up? <laughs> no, Take no. a running jump. <laughs> <laughs> but now this, this is pretty amazing, everybody. Beautiful. Oh, did you ever play Railroad Tycoon? Love that game. I was actually watching Twitch the other day when somebody uh -huh. played, uh, I think it was Sid Meier's Railways, Railroads, like the, the latest, like latest, oh, latest edition. Yeah. It's, oh, yeah. Dude, those, the, the, those feels, those feels getting back. I know, when you build your empire and you get extra lines and, and you see them running about, so cool. Mm, original Cake Train. By Unbearable. Hmm. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a cake train, I guess. I cake don't know. train? Wow. So Antwerp we got... guys need lots of cakes. Trains. Oh, dude, have you seen the sheer size of this place? <clears throat> this must have taken them ages. Holy crappers. Is this beautiful? I think so. Oh, look at this. We got a little speed train down here as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, the good thing about this one is it's going out a tunnel at the end. Let me see. Where's it heading? Fly away from the entrance. Antwerp Berlin. <laughs> and, this is oh, the, yeah. and this is the Eurostar going for London. Really? Over here. Yeah. No. Yeah, it says so. This can't be right. It goes from Paris to London. Does it also go Antwerp? Hmm. I don't know. They might have their oh, own Eurostar. Maybe it because of Brussels and uh, yeah. European Parliament. <laughs> oh, dude, this is a tight squeeze. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Please keep your hands in. Hands and arms yeah. in. In all locations. Damn, dude, this is awesome, though. But damn, it's what a tight squeeze. Don't want to poke your head out the window at the last minute. But you know what? It's kind of like... If you just take a look at this train. I mean, it looks like a train. Mm -hmm. It looks like, I mean, it looks like those wagons and stuff. I mean, it just looks really legit. 
the dark glass for me it really makes it because you, you know how you can't quite see in or you can see the reflections oh yeah it's awesome it is beautiful is there any more layers with trains and stuff um there are, oh yes a few one more layer but no trains i don't think and i even think there's one more layer below this but i didn't manage to get it schematic to over oh dude don't worry about it don't worry about it. I mean, what a fantastic place it is. We've got a flavor of it, right? Oh, everybody. I mean, hopefully you guys will get some inspiration. I know, like, you know, I've, I've done a couple of train stations uh, in the past, and people have been really enjoying them. Uh, so, I mean, this is this is the Antwerp train station. Antwerp, Belgium. And it's beautiful. <laughs> this, is this, this electric, do you think? Electric dude, wires this, up here? This poor freak. Yeah, it's got to be. It's got to be those right yeah oh yeah look look how he down the levers here on the side as well like they're kind of connecting in and stuff oh yeah it holds up the whole structure mm -hmm. beautiful what an amazing train shed and what a great excuse to use <laughs> hundreds and hundreds of bits of red stained glass i know <laughs> right so awesome <laughs> when do you ever get to do that never it's kind of a brave decision actually like I don't that. know. Speechless. Speechless. I mean, th this is inspiration. You know what? I'm just going to check the, 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 the front as well once more. Exhumal, buddy. Did you hug the sign? Oh, I forgot about that. Let's hug <laughs> the sign because we need to hug the sign. Exhumal, it is a fantastic project. And Van Booger, well done. Van, Van Booger. <laughs> GG's, I would say. Dude, those lampposts. Uh, these are fancy. They're tingling my body parts. I mean, look at this. Everybody. I don't know if this is um, Zumiel's design. It could be Bertley, but yeah, I think it might be uh, Kilomarkip or maybe Kilomarkip, yeah. Dan. But mm -hmm. I mean, what a fantastic <laughs> design for a, for a lamp! You know what? Let me just see here. So we got a, just so see people can know, we got some normal stairs. Then we got an anvil. Then we got a normal like stone stone mm -hmm. wall anvil, Hooper Hopper, chiseled stone blocks, brick. Yeah. Anvil, that, and then it just goes up and extends out using the walled pieces. I mean, this is beautiful. It's Absolutely awesome. beautiful. And little, um, I wouldn't have thought of this. See these little blocks here? The wooden fence is sticking down. That's clever. It looks like it comes through the wall. Yeah, yeah, block. yeah. It's kind of like this going up and it's kind of holding up it. The thingy. But dude, that is really smart, by the way. I know. <laughs> you could do a tutorial on this one almost. Sneaky screenshot for me there, I think. Yep, let's do a tutorial on this lamp. <laughs> it's gonna be a very <laughs> short video, but you know what? I yeah. think people would kinda enjoy st stuff like this anyhow. I think so. Dude, that is I mean that is kinda neat, those little windows. I mean that's kinda cool like how you use the lever levers here as well. Yeah. There's tons of space on the inside. Just amazing. Just absolutely amazing. Train's beautiful. Is this a clock? No, it's not a clock. I was like, is this a clock? This is just a window. Um, might be a clock, though. Might be a clock. It's a clock in real life, I think. I'm trying to squint at the picture on Wikipedia was yeah, really Yeah, because, like, I mean, if you just take a pic from from down here, it kind of looks like a clock is kind of like, it has this, like, back lit. It's half past six. Yeah. <laughs> or it's six. Or six, yeah. It's beautiful. Oh, beautiful. a friend of mine made that mistake once. He got up for his paper round when he was 14. <laughs> he thought it was half past six in the morning and he was late for his paper end. It was half past twelve at night. Got up, got dressed, got on his bike. <laughs> <laughs> for real? Yeah. <laughs> oh crap, dude. <laughs> <laughs> this this dome on top is great, actually. It's, I really would like a close look. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. And I mean, those little flags as well, you know what? They are beautiful. I mean, they, mm. looks, they look like actually like flags, like just flapping about in the wind. Yeah. It, it's really good. My flags are like three blocks and then two blocks. <laughs> this is 40 blocks or something. <laughs> Mind blown away. What yeah, a too. beautiful project. And I gotta say, I love the, 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 like, the design here with the upside down stairs on the, on the like entrances and stuff. Yeah. E even the looks... side entrances, but there he used like um, stone bricks. Mm -hmm. oh, it's strong and uh, detailed. Very, very very nice so everybody i'm not gonna keep you longer thank you so 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 much for watching this hopefully you got some inspiration please leave some nice feedback for Schumol in the comment section if you did enjoy this and all those belgian people or people who's been in the antwerp train station let us know yeah did they get it right did it get it right
Is I it, think it's, it's, a, it's a lookalike. Is it similar? For me, it's perfect. They nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, thank you so, so much. Don't forget to comment, like, and favorite. Also, do check out Sandy's point of view. There's going to be a link in the description. Mm hmm. Okay, may the force be with you guys. <laughs> he nailed that one this time. <laughs> Just about. <laughs> <laughs> See you guys, Potato Heart, and bye bye. Better, 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 better